Hi guys, thanks for joining me in the Fitness Coach app. My name is Jason Marklin, professional fighter. Today, I'm gonna to take you guys through a nice cardio boxing hit style workout, all right? We're gonna start with some boxing techniques, then we're gonna go right into the, the hit program, all right? So, everything is two times through. Fairly simple, 30 seconds, upper, lower, core, and a nice little finisher at the end, all right? We're gonna get started in five, four, three, two and one take a step back for me put your hands up by your chin we're gonna go into a jab cross nice and easy one hand forward and the other one back just like this guys we're gonna go into a jab cross keep that hand straight now we're gonna go into a three four also known as hooks so left hook right hook turn that body back and forth pivot that foot then we're gonna go into a nice little uppercut left and right left hand right hand left hand right hand for that uppercut that is your jab cross, that's your offense, that's your hook, that's your uppercut. Now we're gonna go into a little defense, all right? So here, guys, we're gonna drop our hips down. That's called your duck. We're gonna come up, we're gonna slip to our left, slip to our right, roll to our right, roll to our left, all right? Nice and easy. Duck on down for me two times. Slip over two times for me. Make sure you keep your hands up the entire time. You're gonna drop your hips down, roll your shoulder to your left, Roll your shoulder to your right. One more time here. One more time to the right. Now we're gonna put it together. Duck, up, slip, slip, roll, roll. All right, we're gonna put everything together now. That offense and that defense, ready? Jab, cross, nice and slow, hook, hook, uppercut, uppercut. Go into that duck now. Come up, slip, slip, roll, roll. You got it, offense again. Jab, cross, hook, hook, uppercut, uppercut, defense, duck, up, slip, slip, roll, roll. You guys got to keep it going. Jab, cross, hook, hook, uppercut, uppercut, duck, up, slip, slip, roll, roll, fast as you can now. Jab, cross, hook, hook, up, up, duck, up, slip, slip, roll, roll. Catch your quick breath. <laughs> all right, we're going to go down on that ground for boxers. Sit up. So, all right, we're going to pump through for 20 seconds. Sit up and punch. And I'll demo our upcoming workout. So I want you guys to stay down here for me for a while. In three, two, and one, you can sit, relax, get to the next exercise, or you can just keep doing that boxer sit-up. So we're gonna do three exercises. We're gonna do it in 30 seconds a piece. All right, guys, so one exercise here, you're gonna do a T-step, all right? So it's gonna go in, out, back in, back out. All right, that's a nice little quick feed for you, all right? So it's in, out, back in, back out, as fast as you can for 30 seconds. All right, that's your first exercise. Your other exercise is the shuffle squat, all right? Keep your hands up, squat, squat, squat. Your next exercise, you're dropping your hips down, you're moving forward, moving back. Stand up, duck on down, move forward, move back. All right, so we're gonna start with the one we just ended off with. Right, we're gonna drop our hips down, go forward and back. Then we're going to that T-step, then that shuffle squat, all right? They're each 30 seconds, all right? So we got this two times through. Catch your breath, fairly simple. Lock those arms in, hands up in three, two, one. Let's go. Hips down, move forward, move back, stand up, all right? We're gonna pick up the pace in a second, but for now, I want you to just get that rhythm down, up, move back, down, forward, move back. Stay nice and low when you're doing this, all right? When you're going forward and then coming back, that's when you stand, all right? Keep on going now, 10 seconds. Pick that pace up, down, forward, back, and repeat. You're gonna go into that T-step real quick in three, two, and one. For me, guys, as fast as you can. Remember that T-drill. Let's go. Keep your hands up if you can. It's 30 seconds. Remember, in, out, back out, in, out, back in then back out, all right? If you lose yourself, all right? So in, out, in, back out. Keep your knees slightly bent if you can, all right? Keep it going, guys. We're gonna do that shuffle squat in five, four, three, two, and one. Woo, heart's racing. All right, let's go, guys. So you can shuffle two times, you can shuffle four times, depending on how you feel, all right? So shuffle, squat on down, shuffle, squat on down. If you wanna pick the pace up, Feel free, or you can go into a nice little pace. 10 seconds remaining, and then we go back 
to the top. Hopefully you guys know, all know how to squat. You're sitting back in that heel. Get that booty down, all right? Let's go back to the top. Hands up, drop your hips down, move forward, step back, move forward, step back. You got it. Keep your chest up nice and proud. Make sure you're not dipping down. Don't stick the booty out and move like this, all right? Chest up, hips down, and keep moving. 10 seconds. Then we're gonna go into that T-step. You got five, four, three, two, and one. One more time. In, out, back in, back out. All right? Keep your chest up. Keep your hands up if you want. If you wanna drop them, that's perfectly fine. But you're here for 30 seconds, all right? If you wanna take that break, grab some water, feel free, wipe that sweat off. Be my guest, or you're just moving. You've got five more seconds, finish it off, and we're gonna go into that nice shuffle and squat for 30 seconds. In three, two, and one. Remember, if you wanna pick the pace up, you can do as many shuffles as you want, fast as you can, and then squat it out. You got 20 seconds. Then you get a quick one minute break. Then we go into that upper body portion. You need that upper body strength for this part. Keep going guys, five more seconds. Shuffle, squat, 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 and time. Go to work guys, take a sip of water if you need it. Wipe off that sweat, dry off that mat. All right, we're gonna go into, if you need a mat, if you don't have one, grab it right away. We're gonna go into some dive bomb pushups. You're gonna start in a nice high plank. All right, so here, pike your booty up in the air, lock your elbows in, dive on down, come on up. Go back into that high plank or go into that pike, whichever you like, all right? Dive down, come on up, all right? Then the next one we have, it's a beautiful Superman to a plyo push-up. Let that hand leave the ground a little bit. If you want to modify, you can just stay down there for a regular push-up. Then we're here, guys. Basic, high plank, and tap. Try your hardest not to rock those hips. All right, we're going in five, four, three, two, and one. Hit me with that dive bomb, guys. Starting that high plank, shoulder stacked underneath your palm. Bike your butt up in the air, dive on down. Come on up. Try your hardest to keep the knees off the ground if you can. If not, that's perfectly fine. Go back into that high plank. Pike up, dive on down, go back up, dive on down. 10 seconds here, guys. Then we're gonna go right into that Superman to apply your push-ups. Make sure you pull those elbow back to get that scapular locked in, guys. All right, we're going right into it now. Superman, apply your push-up. Once again, your modification is going right back into that regular push-up, or you can do it from your knees. I'm okay with it. If you're a savage, leave the ground. All right? You got five, four, three, two, one. We're going into those plank taps. Remember, shoulders stacked under your palm, guys. Try your hardest not to rock those hips. And we're gonna repeat this one more time. You should feel that shoulders, core, triceps, everything should be on fire right now. All right, five seconds remaining. Then we're gonna go back to the top. That dive bomb push-ups in three, two, one, let's go. Nice high plank, bike on up, dive on down, come on up. If you're feeling tired, drop that knee down on the ground. I'm okay with it. Bike up, dive on down. Pike up, dive on down. 10 more seconds. And we've got that Superman to apply your push up once again. If you want to leave the floor, I'm okay with it. In three, two, one, lift off. Lift off. If you want to feel a froggy, <laughs> get crazy with it if you like. Once again, you can modify with that kneeling push-up. You got 15 seconds, guys. If you want, you can pace yourself with that Superman and that push-up. 
I won't be mad at you, all right? Five more seconds, and we're going into that plank tap. In five, four, three, two, and one. If you wanna challenge yourself, just balance out on that side for a sec. It's the last round here, guys. 20 seconds remaining, and we're gonna attack the core. If this isn't on fire already, Three, two, and one, all right? Now you guys know what you got yourself into. Our core exercise, fairly simple. Three exercises, once again, two times through. It's an L sit up, guys. Your leg stays the same. Try your hardest not to lift your legs. Here, arms over your chest. Come up, extend into the sky. One of my favorite, coming right up. You can do a runner sit up or a bicycle. Just tap the hands in between, all right? So you come up, single, single, double. Single, single, double. Your next is just a hold, all right? So you're here, hold it up with that V. It's gonna be a burner, all right? Just stay here for, for 30 seconds and you are good, all right? So we go in 10 seconds, guys. We're on the ground the entire time. All right, so once again, you can have your legs straight or out. Just think an L shape when you come up, just like this. Ready? In three, two, one. If you're doing this at home, this is easy. If you want to add some resistance, feel free to grab a band. If you want to add some weight, feel free to do that also. But make sure when you come up, chest is nice and proud. Biceps lock to your ears. Up and down. Try your hardest not to slam your back, all right? Nice and easy control of the core and back up. All right, you got five, four, three, two, and one, starting lights and flat, come up, drive that knee into your chest, alternating, tap between. I love this one, it's so much fun. This might challenge your hip flexors, your psoas, that's perfectly fine also, but remember what you're focusing on is that abdominal muscles, all right? You need that for everything in life, any sport you play, especially boxing. You got five, four, three, two, and one, nice and easy. You wanna hold right now, your hips might be in fire, so I'm okay with you hugging those hamstrings. If you feel like a bad baddie, release your hands. If you wanna kick it up a notch, extend and hold. Oh yeah, this is burning. Everything, I'm feeling it. <laughs> if you want, you can just hang out here, or you can test it out, see how you feel. And hold, 10 seconds remaining. You got five, four, three, two, and one. We're going back to the top, guys. Let's go. Oh yeah, did I tell you guys there's a finisher? Woo! I just reminded myself and scared myself here. All right, so <laughs> we've got that coming up. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be a half burpee. <sighs> Woo! With some oblique climbers. We're already doing abs, and I'm telling you about this, guys. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go into those runners in five, four, three, two, and one. Come on up, tap it out for that single. Then you go for that du double. If your hips are burning, your abs are on fire, you guys can stretch it out, chest up, hug that chin, whichever you like, Sh uh, hamstrings, whichever you guys like. You can roll over for an upward dog, stretch out those abdominals, whichever you like. All right, let's go, 10 seconds remaining. It's your last time doing it. You can kick it up a notch. Five, four, three, two, and one. Fantastic work, guys. We are almost there. We're off to that finisher. Now this one's a doozy. You're doing it, two exercises, two exercises, four times each. It's called a Tabata, all right? So we're doing 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off. Ooh, that off is a killer, guys. It's nice and easy planks, kicking that feet out, nice and high planks. That burpee, half burpee, down, oblique climbers, back up in three, two, and one. Let's go, half burpee, oblique climbers, back up. Let's go, burpee, back up. 20 seconds is rolling, guys, 10 seconds remaining. Remember when you do that burpee, just drop your hands down right in front of you, kick your feet out, and go into that oblique climbers. 
You've got two seconds. We're going into that plank and kick your feet out. Let's go, guys. 20 seconds here. This is only round one. That plank, guys, if you want, you can just hold the plank. If you want to modify, you can just tap out, bring it in. If you want to kick it up a notch, you can do it in your forearms. Let's go into that burpee, guys. Let's go. Two, three, and one. Let's go. You can do two oblique climbers. You can do four, whichever you like to work that core. Or you can just do two. You get three, two, and one. Once again, you can do a high plank or a low plank. Kick that feet out. Or you can tap it, depending on if you're injured or not. Your modification, you got this, guys. Five seconds till we go back to that burpee again. In three, two, and one. Drop on down. Five seconds remaining. You got this. So much fun, guys. Hope you're having as much fun as I am. We're down for those plank jacks in three, two, and one. Let's go. Ten seconds remaining. Then we're back up again. You got five, four, three, two, and one. I love burpees, so here we go. Oh yeah, did I tell you guys we're doing this eight times? Oh yeah, eight times. <laughs> so this is a lot of fun. Keep on going, keep that in your mind and you'll be able to complete the exercise. Let's go down for those planks. Let's go. If you have that negative thought, saying I can't do it, I can't make it, your body's just gonna fail. If you say I can do it, your body's gonna push through, find that extra energy and do it guys. You got five, four, Three, two, and one. You guys crushed it. Tricked you guys there with more rounds to go. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining me. Since you're in that kneeling position, guys, I want you to bring that right leg forward. Push that hip forward. Left arm on the ground. Drop that right elbow down. And just open up for me. Nice and easy T-spine stretch. Drop that arm down and switch leg for me. Same deal, posture up. Arm down, T-spine stretch, down guys. Now you're gonna go for an upward dog for me guys. You're doing all those ab work. Stretch out that abs if you have any cramping. This is the spot for you. If you just wanna go into a child's pose, you just relax, just sit back, and you are here. Just hang out there guys. I wanna say thank you guys for joining me on the Fitness Coach app guys. Go on the app. Find some more workouts of mine. Jason Marklin, I am out.